Oh my gosh. Guys, natanggal yung application. <laughs> okay, so, as I was saying, What's up, my homies? It's your girl, Madge, and I'm back with another video. If this is your first time, welcome. It's nice meeting you. I do contents about beauty, travel, and music. So I recently uploaded a song cover called Ikaw Lang Mamahalin. So please check it out after watching this video. So for today's episode, I'm going to do another episode of Learn With Majesty wherein I tackle about the step-by-step -step process on makeup. So for this video, we're going to talk about base makeup. So what's that? It's the foundation, concealer, and powder. So how do I create that flawless, you know, for me it's flawless, you know, uh, the base. And um, if you want to know how to do it, just keep on watching. So, ayun. Kamusta na kayo? Clip ko lang yung hair ko. Just gonna clip my hair. If if no one is asking you, kamusta na kayo? I'm asking you now, kamusta na kayo? So, comment yung lang dyan. If, you know, how do you feel right now? Bakit napavisit ka sa aking video? Um, do you like to learn how to do makeup? Let's get started. Um, so, I click, -click ko lang ang aking... Uh, bangs para mas makita nyo kung paano ko ina-apply yung ating foundation. But first, uh, paano ba pumili ng tamang foundation for your skin tone? Okay. So, lahat tayo iba-iba. So, my skin tone might, might not be the same as yours. My problem might not be the same as yours. I'm just gonna discuss about how to pick a shade siguro muna. So, how do I pick a shade? So, for example, you're in a store and there are a lot of shades to choose from. Dito tayo sa drugstore mo na na makeup or foundation. This is Maybelline Fit Me. So what will you do is that so may tester sila, di ba? And then kuha ka ng product and then i-apply mo siya sa iyong uh, parang ano dito? Panga, malapit sa neck. Ganyan. See? Okay. And then, mag-stroll, stroll ka muna, ganyan. Uh, Mag-window shopping ka muna. And then after, you will check kung alin yung pasok na shade. Okay. So, alimbawa, syempre, hindi naman iisa lang ilalagay mo. So, maglagay din tayo. So, since I only have one Maybelline, um, this is uh, Wet n Wild Foundation. This is Photo Focus Foundation. So, maglagay tayo dito. So, ayan. Ayan. Okay, so basically the goal is ano yung magbe-blend sa iyong skin tone. Dapat yung equal equal or match yung shade ng face mo at saka ng neck. Next, let's try itong ColourPop a no filter foundation. So magpampa ko ng konting konti. And then I'm gonna put it here. So, I have three shades of foundation. So, obviously, parang wala nang nag, nagmamatch. Kasi, syempre, nag-pandemic and hindi na ako naaarawan. <laughs> Kaya, parang ganyan lang siya. So, iba-iba yan, di ba? Tingnan nyo to. Um, ito, medyo light sa akin. Ito, too dark. Yung Maybelline. Maybelline? Paano ako nabibis? Maybelline, medyo too dark. And then, this one is the color pop. So, um, pagka-blend nyo ng ganyan and you should pick the foundation that is hindi gaanong nahahalata like the color pop foundation so this one mapute, dark and then this yung ito yung ano mo, ito yung magiging shade mo so when you blend the product dito sa part ng iyong face tapos kakulay na siya ng skin mo and then that's the perfect Okay, so now, dahil nga online shopping lang tayo, there are a lot of swatches doon sa shop. Uh, make sure na kapag bibili kayo ng foundation or concealer, 
the shop should have swatches doon sa kanilang store. And if you are not sure, type in nyo lang sa search bar kung ano yung foundation and the shade. Okay? Kasi there are vloggers na nag-swatch ng different shades or different foundation, including, you know, lahat ng shades. So, the technique that I can suggest is that search for the foundation name and the shade. Lalabas yan sa, you know, sa search results para makita mo kung may video, kung may um, different swatches sa iba't ibang skin tone. So, hahanap ka ng kasing um, kakulay mo and then you watch it. And then, you know, you estimate. So, best if meron ka namang... Ano ba yun? Tumatasdas. <laughs> best if may budget ka naman, bili ka na lang dalawa, di ba? Kasi pwede ka naman mag-mix. So, ito, isa, isa pang tip is that you can mix two shades of foundation or concealer if wala ka doon sa um, shade range ng product. Okay, so, yun yung pagpili ng shade ng foundation. Ngayon naman, yung coverage is uh, depending on your need. For example, on my skin or my face, I only have like yung mga, you know, little spots, ayan. So, uneven skin tone kasi may dark circles ako and then yung may mga ganyan. So, pag may mga tinutubuan, so gusto ko lang mag-even out yung aking complexion, kumbaga. So, hindi ako nagahanap ng full coverage. If meron ka naman mga pimples, then I suggest to gahanap ka ng foundation na full coverage. So, for me, I only select yung mga medium coverage lang or yung mga skin light lang. If you want to know paano mag-cover ng pimples or you know para mag-blur out yung ang inyong mga dark spot, I did my sister's makeup so siya medyo um nagbe-break out siya. Um doon sa video na yon, I showed how I blurred out yung kanyang mga pimples and yeah, you should check it out after this video. Basically, it depends talaga kung ano yung mga needs ninyo, but I will be giving you, you know, yung mga basic na dapat malaman about the base makeup, pa paano ko ginagawa yung sa akin, and hopefully, maging effective din yun sa inyo, okay? So, first, um, I will answer some of the questions that the Majesties us asked me. So, sa mga hindi nakakaalam, I have this support group that is called Majesties, and um, I ask them, ano yung mga question ninyo about the base makeup, and I will answer them through my next video. So, ito na yun, guys. Okay. So, first question from Gaya is, do you really need to prep your face with ice cubes to close the pores? Okay, this is uh, regarding the skin preparation. Um, you don't necessarily need, kasi sabi niya, do you really need? Okay. It, 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 for me, ah, for me, it's not necessary but if you do that, okay lang naman. But, alam mo yun, uh, gawin mo siya, for me, gawin mo siya uh, minutes before you put on some makeup. Kasi parang mag, para um, iset, i-feel mo muna na nag-close talaga yung pores mo. But for me, yung mga primers na nag-fill in ng pores or nag-blur out, blur out ng pores, it's enough for me. So, I must, I must say na hindi naman siya necessary, but if it's effective for you, then go for it. Next question from Gaya pa rin. Napaka-active nito ni Gaya. Best fonda for everyday look? Okay. Uh, siguro ang, ang sinasabi niya na everyday look, pang everyday look, I would suggest Maybelline Fit Me kasi super affordable naman siya. But I would not recommend to use foundation everyday. Siguro parang everyday lang, na parang pang daily lang na look. Maganda yung Maybelline Fit Me. But if literal na araw-arawin mo yung foundation, wag naman kasi there are, you know, BB cream, CC cream, yung mga color correcting yung mga cream, or yung mga sunscreen, yun yung ide-daily natin. Pero kung gusto nyo lang na parang everyday look na foundation, I would recommend yung Maybelline Fit Me. Kasi hindi siya full coverage, pwede rin siyang uh, skin-like lang na coverage. And I would recommend itong Colourpop, but limited lang. Sa site lang ng Colourpop, nakakabili ng ganitong foundation. So, the next question um, actually, three questions now. It's from Yuki. What is the one product that you can't 
work without. So, I think this is not related to base makeup. Sabi niya, one product that you, you can't work without. Mm, I think the angled brush with a spoolie para sa aking kilay. Of course, kilay is life, diba? So, paano ko makapagkilay na wala yun? So, yun yung unang-unang pumasok sa isip. Okay, anyway, so let's prep the skin. I will use this Morwell Skin Shield Spray. I'm gonna spray it all over my face. So that will hydrate my skin. So kapag naman feeling mo, hindi mo na need mag-hydrate, okay lang. Bawa, fresh from the shower, ganyan. So pwede ka nang dumiretso doon sa iyong primer. Next for my skincare, medyo na-addict ako dito sa aloe vera soothing gel. So I'm gonna apply some. Ang secret din sa flawless na base makeup is your skin preparation. So get to know kung ano yung mga skincare na talagang hiyang sa inyo. So be careful lang talaga sa pag apply ng mga skincare. Kailangan talaga yung swak na swak lang din sa face mo. Next, I'm gonna be applying this Tomato Day Serum by Iris Essentials PH. They have a skincare set, so you should try that out. Malay mo, yun yung maging swak sa yung skin. So for the primer, I'm currently obsessed with this Maybelline Baby Skin Pore Eraser. It's kind of like erasing talaga my pores. So, konting-konti lang. I like that. So basically, putting your primer doon lang sa iyong T-zone. Kasi doon yung mostly na kailangan ko i-fill in yung pores. Okay, so now you're ready to apply your foundation. So ang napili natin kanina is this Colourpop No Filter Foundation. I am in the shade Medium 80. So wala akong, um, what do you call that, yung palette. So I'm gonna put that behind or at the back of my hand so two pumps like that and then what I love to do is I'm going in with my finger and then saka ko siya i-apply all over the edge ng aking face so you can focus on the areas that you need coverage ayan so like what I'm doing right now so now, we're gonna blend that using itong Mama Anne's na flat brush. When you feel like kailangan mo pa ng coverage, it's okay to add more foundation. And then you blend with a beauty sponge. So see, see how the foundation just, you know, covering the skin. I mean, hindi siya ganun full coverage it's like you know enhancing my skin tone katulad ng sinabi ko kanina it's okay to put more foundation and then you blend with the beauty sponge but if you're satisfied then go go ahead and blend that with the beauty sponge so I'm just gonna spray that so, mas maganda kasi na parang wet or dump. And then, I'll make sure lang na talagang na-absorb ng aking face or ng aking skin yung foundation. So, the purpose of, you know, applying foundation is to even out your skin tone. So, makikita nyo pe, dito medyo, um, medyo na-even out na siya. Kanina, may mga spots-spots ako dyan, yung mga ugat-ugat ko. So, yun yung nagagawa ng foundation. So, and now, we're gonna put in some concealer. So, concealer, since I use Colourpop doon sa ating foundation, I'm gonna use Colourpop as well sa ating concealer. So, I am in the shade Light 16. This is also the No Filter collection. So, I'm just, when putting your concealer, uh, it also depends. I like to put it here. So, hindi ganun kalapit sa iyong under eye or kung saan nag-crease. Okay. So, I put it away. 
Kasi kung mas maraming product doon sa dibo, diba doon maraming fold sa may eyes, ayan, doon din kasi nag-create. So, lagay na rin tayo, mag-highlight na rin tayo dito. So, ang um, the purpose of concealer, oh my gosh! Guys, natanggal yung applicator. <laughs> okay, so, as I was saying, <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. So, ang concealer, not only to um, conceal or hide yung dark spot, it's also used for highlighting. So, let me just spread this with a little sponge. This is Morphe Jeffree Star na sponge. So, ganyan yung ginagawa ko. Just gonna blend that. So, starting a wig like that. So, parang slowly, it work out mo siya towards yung sa inner. So, gently lang kasi napaka-sensitive. Same sa foundation, sa concealer, if you feel like meron ka bang need na i-cover, just go ahead and cover them. So, since nasira nga ang ating color pa concealer, I'm gonna use Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. This is um, in the shade. What shade is? This is sand, okay? So, I would like to cover more here kasi nandun yung aking mga pimps. And then more here, here, and then dito yung mga may redness. And then more pa here kasi medyo, ano, maitim sila. Ayan. So, ganun. Kung saan lang yung areas na gusto mong takpan. So, pag may blend is perfect talaga tong mga, ano, mga beauty sponge. Kasi nabiblend well na sila agad. So, I'm gonna use a Nichido powder. I got a lot of suggestions na powder. Actually, this is very good, you know. I just wanna try yung ibang mga powder out there. So, yun yung purpose ko pang nagtanong din sa last video. Using yung ano, yung etong what you call that, yung flat area. I'm just gonna get some. And then putting it under my eye. So just pressing. So and I also like to put it here, para mas magkaroon ng ano ba? Para mas maging ganon yung ilong ko. Okay. So we're gonna bake the under eye, and we will set everything with Vice Duo Finish Foundation. But let me do my brows off cam and I'll go back, you know, setting my face with powder. We're done with the kilay. I just used Iris PH Brow Pomade. This is in the shade Cool Black. Now it's time to remove your own powder. I'm gonna use Anclut's Powder Brush. This brush. And then I'm gonna dip in dito sa Vice. DFF. I'm in the shade Rina Mez. So I'm just gonna, you know, wipe that. I just find it really flawless when I do that. And then, don't forget to set everything. Don't forget to bronze. Because when you do your foundation, your face is gonna be flat. So it's important that you return that shadow. So I'm gonna use Vice Aura Contour. This is in the shade for sure. I'm gonna use Anclut's brush. This is their contour brush. So I'm just gonna dip in. Top, dip in top. And here. I'm also planning to do a detailed, you know, tutorial on bronzing, contouring, and highlight. So let, let me know in the comment section what are your questions about contour and I'll try to answer them. So basically, that is your base makeup. So let me just finish up my makeup and I'll be right back. So now, don't forget to set everything with your favorite facial mist. So I'm gonna use Morwell Skin again, the thing that we used earlier. Yeah. So it's okay na mag-apply ka lang ng mist na as many as you want. So this is the eye look that I made. It's just, you know, a winged eyeliner and um, eyeshadow that I use from the One Size 
beauty visionary palette so i'm i'm not gonna complete my look for this video just watch out for my ig post okay so that's the foundation tutorial and i want to shout out okay so shout out to fifi star who is our first commenter sa ating classic red blend using vice cosmetics so if hindi mo pa napapanood i'm gonna put the link below in the description box so shout out to fifi and let me just feature the comment of the day Thank you so much for posting your comments and for continuously supporting me. So that's it for now. Let me know if natuto kang mag foundation after watching this video. So follow me on my social media accounts. Meron akong Majly Parte. That's my personal account. My makeup collection is Majestic Glam, and I also have a travel blog or travel, you know, photos collection that is Majestic Travel. So see you on my next video. Bye.